Holidays are a time to catch up with old acquaintances and some who aren't so old. Chip Reed spent time with a young scientist whose ideas keep getting bigger. When we first met Olivia McConnell two years ago, she was leading a campaign to make the woolly mammoth the South Carolina state fossil. Olivia McConnell. <laughs> now 11, she's still making headlines. She and friends Riley Sims and Emily Palmer have won first place in seven science fairs in a row. Remember, you cannot touch the disc. Olivia insists they're a team, but it's pretty clear who's in charge. This prize-winning experiment begins with the girls swabbing E. coli onto petri dishes. Then they soak small pieces of paper in a solution of tobacco, place the paper on the E. coli, put it in an oven, and wait 24 hours to see if the tobacco kills the E. coli. So you think that this could actually be a cure for E. coli? It possibly could. I hope it can. Sounds like there's a Nobel Prize for science in this. <laughs> You're thinking what I'm thinking. She's a pretty remarkable young lady. <laughs> and Jack, a University of Kentucky tobacco researcher, says Olivia has all the makings of a great scientist. She has the ability to persevere with something and get it right. Jack. Persevere just might be an understatement. Whose house is that? Mine. Last year, a massive flood destroyed her family's home and all the tobacco she had so carefully prepared. Did you think that your experiment was over? I never think that. You never do? Never. I don't like to think I can't do this because everything is possible. Where did you get that attitude? Probably from my grandma and my mom. I inherited it from the girls in my family. Earlier this year, Olivia and her team, believe it or not, came in second at a science fair. They say a little adversity builds character, but it's hard to imagine she needs any more of that. I've been told that. <laughs> Chip Reed, CBS News, Lake City, South Carolina. Remember the name Olivia McConnell. Well, that's the CBS Evening News for Scott Pelley. I'm Margaret Brennan. Thank you all for watching, and have a great night.